So this is the aerodynamics of the halo pelican. If you don't know what halo is, okay, everyone makes mistakes in their lives, but try to do better. Make sure you go out and play it. And I put some streamlines around it and it looks so cool. Like you have the streamlines mostly going over and over the wings and then they get sucked in and back into this cargo area. So the streamlines here, they get sucked in, for example. And how cool is it? The Halo Pelican. The funny thing about this is that <laughs> the lift is actually negative. It, at this angle of attack is minus 0 0.5 approximately. So it's not really uh, producing any lift. It's actually downforce. And these are glyphs. They show the direction of the flow. And they all look pretty normal until you get to the back of the cargo bit here, just, just there. So you can see all these arrows are actually going the other way. So the string, the flows that's here, it, it um, hits this door, I guess, and comes all the way down. And you can see all this flow rushing out and then rushing back in as well. So there's this really turbulent, chaotic flow and then even some uh, vortice, vorticity around there. And the rest is how you'd expect it. And this is the UMAG um, color plot, and it's going in the Y plane and through the Pelican. And it all looks pretty good. Like there is quite a bit of wake there, but as soon as you get to the cargo area, that's where the wake blows out. I like, look at that. The wake is so much bigger now down here. And the, interestingly, the flow over the, um, the middle of it doesn't really accelerate that much actually accelerates down underneath here, which is why we get that negative lift. And for this video, I put three different streamlined sections. I wanted to see where the flow is really getting sucked from and where it's staying aligned with the rest of the craft. So like at this angle here, you can kind of see that the blue, it just stays over the middle of the pelican, whereas the yellow gets sucked into this wake here that's effectively covered underneath the, the pelican. And the red does a little bit too. So it seems like all the flow that's underneath in this cargo area is getting sucked from the sides in. And the underneath, this flow doesn't get sucked back in. It just keeps zipping along.